how to upload files to Firebase in React application. First, I'm going to generate new React app using npx create React app Firebase file upload. Then I'm going to run Firebase init. Make sure to install Firebase tools globally to be able to run Firebase command. To upload images, I will need to enable storage. So I press space and enter. I will create new project and I will call it FRB FLS example. It will create a new Google Cloud Platform project for me. Firebase CLI created a new project for us, but it wasn't able to enable the cloud storage. So we'll need to go to the console and do it manually. So I go to FRB FLS example. I select storage. Press get started. Next. And now we'll need to set the cloud storage location. I will choose Europe West. And done. Okay, the storage is created. Now, after I've set up location for the storage service, I can run Firebase init again. You don't have to do it if you already have your location set up using some other service. I select storage, use an existing project, and we'll use FRB FLS example. Select storage rules, and we'll, we're set up now. Firebase CLI created a bunch of files for us. One of the files is Firebase JSON, which sets up the rules for the storage service. You can change the rules in the storage.rules file, and we need to do it in order to allow file uploads without authentication. So we remove this part, saying that we allow write access if request has auth if auth is not equal null. I'm doing it temporarily and only to demonstrate how file upload work. If you enable authentication in your application, you probably want to enable file upload only for authenticated users. To deploy your updated rules, you need to run Firebase deploy only storage. To make sure that everything worked correctly, you can go to your project settings, storage, rules, and you should see that uh, the rules are actually updated. Now go back to your project settings and create new app for a project. I'll call it FRB FLS example, just like project name. We don't need hosting, register app. Copy the settings, then go back to your editor and we need to install the Firebase package. Yarn add Firebase. Now inside your SRC folder create a new file called base.js. Paste your settings here. And now we'll need to make a bunch of changes. First, import Firebase. Import asterisk as Firebase from Firebase app. Then you need to import Firebase storage to enable storage capabilities. Import Firebase storage. Now change this var to const and save the result of calling Firebase initialize app to the app constant. And now export the app constant. Now go to src app.js and remove all the layout that create react app generated for us. Instead, we'll render input type file on change. We will set up an on change handler for this input. 
let's call it on change and define a new handler in this change handler we'll need to handle event and first we need to get the reference to our file we define a const file it equals event target files zero if you have more than one file then you might have to look through the list of files that you will get there now we need to import the app that we defined here expert const app we import it from our base file and in our on change handler after we got the file reference we define the storage ref const storage ref equals app dot storage ref and then we create a new file there const file ref equals storage ref child file name so you so we use the name of our file that we got from the input to create a new file on Firestore, on Firebase, on Firebase storage. Then we use this file ref to actually put the data. We put our file from the input and then when the file will be uploaded, we will log a message let's remove the logo reference and run our application in your browser you should see the button it is our file input select some file I will select an image upload it In the console you should see uploaded the file if everything went successfully or an error if something went wrong. Now you can go to storage in Firebase and check if the file was uploaded successfully. So here is our file. So it works. Thank you for watching. Example code for this tutorial will be in the description. You will have to create your own Firebase project for it, but the React code will be there.